There's some tension between the U.S. and Turkey right now, and their dictator, Erdogan, who he wants to be the king of the caliphate. But then here we have a Turkish man attempting to break into the cockpit of an L.A. to Hawaii flight, according to this report. And I'm just going to scroll through because there's images to look at and things to discuss. Now, Hawaiian Air National Guard F-22 jets were scrambled to escort American Airlines Flight 31 after a man reported to be Turkish. What did he do? Say, hi, I'm Turkish. I want to break into your cockpit. After a man reported to be Turkish tried to break through the cockpit door of a commercial plane flying from Los Angeles to Honolulu. Crew members and an off-duty Honolulu police officer subdued a Turkish man after he attempted to break down the cockpit door after the flight departed Los Angeles International Airport on Friday, that was yesterday, uh, May 19th, at 8.34 a.m. local time. This is what Hawaii News Now reported. Okay, here is an image of the, him being escorted off the plane, and it's part of this tweet. Turkish man escorted off American air, but, but there was... Okay, so there's always tweets to look at. U.S. Pacific Command ordered two F-22 report... Raptors, excuse me, from the Hawaii Air National Guard to escort the Airbus A321 into Honolulu International Airport. And there is, uh, of course, this fellow has pictures of the raptor, or one of the raptors, in his tweet, taking off from Honolulu. But I think um, this is what jumps out at me, and, and I'd like to know what you think of this. Sources reportedly told Hawaii News Now that the man also breached security. He breached security at Los Angeles International Airport, but that, hey, that he was... Um, assessed and allowed to board the flight anyway. So he breached security, but he was assessed and allowed to board the flight anyway. Did he give them a good story that he was just lost? Well, I didn't uh, I didn't mean to go this way. I meant to go this way. All right, sir, you go right ahead and board. And, of course, you have... Um, Comments from those who were on the plane. Crazy, someone tried to break into the cockpit on my flight from L.A. to Honolulu. We were greeted by the FBI. They are now taking us off the plane a few rows at a time for dog sniffing and interviews. I've never seen anything like this. And with hashtag CNN, FBI, USA, Homeland Security, etc. Any interested news outlets are welcome to use my footage. Please credit uh, the source. Now, uh, the U.S. Department of Homeland Security, which oversees the TSA, or Transportation Security Administration, if you didn't know what that acronym stood for, issued a statement saying, We continue to monitor all flights out of an abundance of caution. Well, obviously, there wasn't much of an abundance of caution used when this Turkish man breached security before boarding the plane. Now, at this time, there are no other disruptions of flights. Well, that's good. I feel better about that. All right, so here's some more images of the scene yesterday. There's um, the authorities out there on the tarmac. Makes me think of Cartman. Respect my authority. From uh, South Park. You may be familiar with that when Cartman was a police officer. But anyway, uh, American Airlines spokeswoman Katie Cody told the Associated Press that there were 181 passengers and six crew members aboard the flight, but that no injuries were reported. I guess, folks, the reason why I brought this attention is I'm always curious to know what you think. Um, he breached security, but then they let him on the, the plane anyway. And there seems to be a great emphasis on him being Turkish. And uh, Turkey is certainly a source of much tension in the world right now. Was this a uh, a false flag that maybe didn't uh, didn't work out? Was this an attempt to bring this plane down? I I just thought I'm putting these thoughts out there. Uh, did something go wrong? Uh, was there a larger plan at play here? Anyway, let me know what you think, folks. 
And as always, I remind you, do not be given over to the spirit of fear, but of the power of love and of a sound mind, which comes through our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ. Please give this video a thumbs up if you would. Please subscribe to my channel if you've yet to do so. And if I could be so bold, please, if you get a moment, check out my link to a couple of songs. I have a significant catalog. There's a couple I'd like you to hear. And also the link to my fiction books on Amazon. And if you are a watcher of the world, you would like my books perhaps, and you might like the one I'm working on right now. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, I appreciate you. This is Jim signing off, and I will see you soon.